have a beautiful home. You probably can't see. Hi guys! So on this video, I'm so excited because I'm going to be doing a DIY gift idea that I did for my sister. And it's a, a lamp. And I really hope you like it. So it takes a little time, but I really think it's worth it. Um, so there is a, 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 a little tricky part in the DIY that you probably will need the, the help for your dad or something. But also, you can, instead of using a lamp, you can just use a candle and we'll give it the same, exactly the same effect and it also will be really really cute and it's a way more easy at least you get it and then you can do it yourself and you are amazing if you have any question please leave it in the comments below and I will try to answer and also if you did it please 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 send me to a my Instagram. But the part of the DIY that it takes a little time, you can also replace it for fake flowers. I, I just wanted to do all by my own because I think it was a challenge and I really want to try it. But if you don't, it's totally up to you and it's also get really cute. It gets more like summer time and mine is more, more like simple and cute and white. <laughs> because the flowers are white. So, these are my inspirations. The links will be down below. So, you're just gonna need a half of a bottle of fly or detergent and you can cut, uh, cut it with a knife. The, after that step, you will cut the irregularities with the scissor. Now, jump into the flowers, you will need some kind of translucent paper. I'm using grey spruce paper. And we'll also need a ruler, a pencil and scissors. Start measuring your paper vertically with 5 inch each and do two lines with that measure. And now just cut them. At this point, I had saw that you should craze your paper, but I tried it and it out, and the results are exactly the same. So. For the, the flowers, you just need to boil a little the paper, like I'm doing, and revolve it. In the start, it look, looks a little hard, but after two or three times, you get used to it. After you have a bunch of flowers, you will cut a little in the end and with a glue gun apply them into the bottle. And now it's all about doing that until it's all filled. I know it takes a little time. Once you get like half done with some iron and a candle, you will arm up the iron and perforate the plastic. It will be quite easy because the plastic will melt with the temperature. Once that's finished, ask for your dad or mom or follow the instructions in your lamp and apply that into your stand and pass the wire in the bottle. Or you can also use a candle, as I said before.
now continue continue glowing the flowers and voila it's done <laughs> So please, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I will see you next time.